Hey what's up guys, Tim here. Got another tutorial for you today and it's a brief one uh, but with that in mind it is on what you see here this is the Celtic button knot or single strand diamond knot I'm sure there are other names for it but um, yeah as you can see it is looks wise it is pretty much the same as the two strand diamond knot but of course uh, in the name it uses the single strand okay so you can use this knot to decorate your lanyards, your bracelets, and whatnot. And uh, it's very simple. So, uh, with that out of the way, let's get to the tutorial. All right, so I've got my piece of paracord. And uh, it doesn't really matter what length. Uh, of course, it'll just depend on what you are tying your knot onto. Okay. So, uh, first things first, you're going to make a loop like this. Right, and then you're going to make a second loop. And you're gonna just kind of lay it on top of the first one like that. So you want them with that little space in the middle, kind of like a Venn diagram. Okay, so or it kind of looks like a pretzel too. Um, so from there, you're going to take the right side or the other end of the string. You're gonna go over this one, over the very right side under the next strand and through the middle of the uh, the two strands in the middle and then you're gonna go under the last one so it's just over under over under okay like that so you should be here at this point all right from there you're gonna grab the strand you were working with and you're gonna bring it just around so I just haven't done anything really fancy yet, just brought it around here. And now you see this loop here, it kind of looks like a, I guess like a three loaf, uh, three leaf clover. Uh, on this third loop here, you're going to go over this one, this one here, you're going to over, under the next two, and then through the middle here. Okay? So you had your one, two, three loops. You go over the right one, underneath the next two, and through the middle. Okay, that's it. And then from there, you're just gonna pull your string. Now you're gonna have it, it looks kind of messy, but all you have to do now is work out all the slack, and uh, you will have your knot. Okay, so I'm just gonna slowly work out all the slack. All right, so I've got most of the slack worked out. You can pull it pretty tight at this point. You can also kind of like roll it in between your fingers, and that kind of uh, helps tighten up the knot. And there you have it, guys. That was it. There is your Celtic button knot, also known as a single strand diamond knot. And it's very pretty. Okay. So yeah, very simple, guys. Um, just a few steps to it, and uh, you will have yourself a Celtic button knot. Okay, so I hope that was easy enough to understand and I hope I went through it slowly enough. If not, just hit that replay button and uh, give it another go. But um, yeah, that's it guys. That is the Celtic button knot tutorial. See, I've got two tied up really nicely here. And I uh, hope you enjoyed this tutorial. And uh, please let me know what you guys think. And if you guys like the video, please hit like. That helps me out a lot. Okay, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.